kind of a sad day for the uh, for the GTR. Selling the TEs, put the 2020s on, which I think really look good. Um, and then getting ready to, to list it. I got the TEs, great wheels. Yeah, getting ready to sell it. Um, and then hopefully in the next year or two, get something else to, to replace it. And it is kind of sad. However, I when I was taking off the wheels last night, kind of had my moment with it, with the GTR, and, and kind of you know came to uh, you know an okay to move on. Um, whoever gets this is going to get a really really nice car. I mean, this was fully taken care of. I have the paperwork for everything that has been done to this car. The two owners before me had all the paperwork. I mean, it even has the original Japanese shipping label when this car shipped over in 2009. So well kept. Uh, well documented, everything is on my YouTube channel. Um, all the replacements, all the big replacements uh, that people are wary of 2009s and um, I essentially turned it into a 2020. And um, it, it, the car's great, the car, car is absolutely perfect. So um, the FD will keep me busy. Um, it's wrapping up, um, it should be done here within the next month or so. I've come to peace with, with getting rid of the GTR, so underrated thing about the car community is how impactful um not in the materialistic sense but how impactful what you drive can can open doors for you opportunities outside of the car world and stuff like that so we'll see what happens we'll see what happens next so all right so a couple things before we sell the gtr um the main issue that i have with it is that i just need to replace the battery essentially had it for over about five years, been tendering it the whole time. And so, um, yeah, this will be good for the new owner um, so that it starts up on first crank. So, uh, yeah, let's hop into it. That's pretty much it. I did end up zip tying the the back upright mount to the mount that's on the chassis, so um, should be all right. Um, battery's not going anywhere. Battery tray's in there. Everything is secured. That's pretty much it. All right. So a couple more things in closing. Um, two main points. Uh, first is the a question I get a lot, or I'm getting a lot, is what's next. So what's next? Um, really, we're diving into the FDR X7 build. Uh, I'm excited to share that we have a full series coming out for that. Um, coincidingly, um, I've been working with uh, my good friend Ross Chester. Um, we are going to be building a series around his um, R33 Skyline build as well um, and kind of have that 90s Japanese uh, series kind of working together. So if that's something that interests you, uh, please be sure to subscribe. Number two uh, question I'm getting is where I am selling the car. Um, so I've actually listed it on Cars and Bids and I've been working with David Abrahamovich of Dave's uh, David's Car Concierge. And so I do a lot of his pictures um, for, for listing photos and stuff of cars. And honestly, if it wasn't for him, uh, I would still be kicking this can down the road of selling the GTR. So thank you, David, for that final push that I needed. Um, he basically takes care of everything cars and bids related. Um, he'll re receive your car, he'll get pictures taken, he'll, he'll negotiate with uh, cars and bids on what the MSRP should be. Um, he manages all the comments. Um, he's really a one-stop shop um, and, and has made it super easy to sell my car um, where I couldn't say no. So um, I'll leave his information uh, down below as well. And then lastly, I'll leave the link for the Cars and Bids um, auction uh, for my GTR. Um, I would appreciate if you guys would share that out um, so that we can at least meet my reserve. Um, that would be greatly appreciated. And thanks again, just for the GTR community, the car community, everybody that I've met through um, having this car and the relationships I've been able to build, the experience I've been able to experience. Um, thank you. A huge thank you to, to anyone and everyone um, who has been involved. And with that, I'm going to close this video, but I'm going to have 
a commemoration to the GTR, a montage, if you will. Uh, so if you stuck around this long, um, thank you. Um, enjoy the rest of the video, and I will catch you guys on the next video. Peace.